Okay, so your son, Hal, yes. who's how old? He's four and a half. Four and a half. Sweet, sweet Hal. Yes. Hal's been in a crib yes. since birth until about a week ago. Yes. So um, I was What ill. happened? I was quarantined. You were quarantined. I was we know pushed what that away. means. Yeah, yes. you know, I had the COVID. Yeah. I was pushed away into my room watching all that was on television. Everything. And Hal was free to be me himself. That's true. He and was then free to be himself. You and me. What happened? <laughs> and so, what happened? so Henry heard him say, Daddy, Daddy. And he went and he said, I'm ready. And mm -hmm. Henry said, what, You're ready for what? He said, I need to move into my big boy bed. So the big boy bed's been waiting just been whenever he's ready. It's been in the room ready. for about two years. <laughs> and <gasps> there he is. Oh, little angel house. But it all happened without his mother's help. <laughs> and that leads me to wonder if I'm too overbearing. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes just to him, the other is I. You let them be. It's it so is anyway. funny because sometimes when we are out of the picture, yeah. we think nothing, no changes are going to ha happen without our urging guidance. or cheering or guidance. I mean, I was, now, because y'all had shamed me and really the whole community had shamed me <laughs> for the fact that he was in the crib. You all have shamed me a little. And I said, okay, how? I think it's time. Some friends have said it's yeah, time to move. He and say? he was not ready. He was scared. You know what I love? He, he really did tell you when he was ready. Yes. And what difference does it make if he's in a crib or in a bed? No. And when he's 20, he's not going to remember he was in a bed till he was four and a half. Well, he'll remember because it's going to be in. Oh, right. <laughs> this will live on the internet.